welcome back to uh, Smoke Meat with Jeff for cocktail hour. Uh, well, during my videos you see me usually with a drink in my hand and today I'm going to show you how to make one of my favorites. Uh, it's very similar to the ginger whiskey that we have made in the past but today we're going to do a ginger tangeray and tonic. Very refreshing drink especially on a hot day when you've uh, got your meat on the smoker and you're just waiting around for it to cook. So uh, what we're going to need for this today are some very basic ingredients. You're going to need a uh, grapefruit, I prefer the ruby red, a lemon, some ginger that you're going to freshly grate. Uh, if you need to know how to grate fresh ginger, check out one of my other videos in the basic section. You are going to need, of course, some tangeray. Uh, you can use another gin if you'd like. And of course, some tonic water. This is going to make enough to uh, make three cocktails, which will last you through a typical uh, three or four hour smoking session, or invite some friends over and, and share this recipe with them. Uh, so let's get started on uh, showing you how to make this drink. All right, gather up some of your basic bartending supplies. Uh, you're going to need a glass for mixing in, as well as muddling. You're going to need a muddling stick. You're going to need a strainer. And of course, you're going to need some uh, some ice for your drink, as well as some ice for for mixing this. And I've got some simple. Well, actually, mine's the complex syrup, but this is made with uh, simple syrup, which is uh, very easy to make with white sugar. But I do it with brown sugar. Uh, I just prefer the the sweetness of that. Uh, to make this drink, you're going to take the uh, grapefruit and the lemon. You're going to slice it into uh, about quarter inch slices. Uh, so typically like that and then you can see on here I actually cut off a little bit of the rind uh, just to make it a little bit easier to muddle and you're going to put a couple pieces of grapefruit did the same thing with uh, the lemon and then you need about two tablespoons of freshly grated ginger which I have here and again if you want to know how to grate ginger check out one of my other YouTube videos for this you're going to need about an ounce of either simple syrup or the complicated syrup if you like to make it with the uh, the brown sugar like I do. About three ounces of tangeray or your other favorite gin. That's looking good. Should keep me nice and hydrated and uh, refreshed during my, my smoking uh, process today. Muddling stick. I just made this one out of an old piece of uh, furniture. I think it was a chair leg. Cut off the top and just uh, kind of roughed it up a little bit. And we're just going to take this uh, this little concoction here and we're going to muddle it together. Just really squeeze all those juices into the, uh, the gin and really mix in that ginger. All right, that's looking pretty good. From here we're going to add some ice and then we're going to shake this up. Grab your strainer, your glass with some ice in it, and you're going to fill it about halfway, like so. And then we're going to top it off with some tonic water. Now if you're a whiskey drinker, uh, check out my other cocktail time uh, video where I show you how to make a ginger whiskey, which is pretty much identical to this recipe with switching out the uh, gin for whiskey and the tonic water for some ginger ale. So cheers! Oh, that's perfect. I love gin. Sweetens it up a little bit with that uh, complicated uh, syrup. Perfect for uh, keeping me cool. I've got the, the smoker going on in here in the background. So, until uh, next time, enjoy your cocktails.